Thank you very much for that. In a story which could have implications for PSU banks, now the MTNL account is likely to slip into NPA category for most lenders in the current quarter because MTNL has defaulted in its repayments. Ritu joins in for more on that. Ritu. Well, here you have the case of MTNL, a government-owned entity which has defaulted on its loan repayments and is now asking state-owned lenders to take a significant haircut, a proposal that has not been well received by banks. Now, after missing loan repayments for the past few months, we understand MTNL is expected to slip into the NPA category for most of these lenders in the current quarter. The likes of Union Bank of India and Bank of India have already classified the account as an NPA and others like State Bank of India, Yuko Bank, Punjab National Bank and others are likely to follow in the coming weeks. Now, banks have made it clear to MTNL while they are open to restructuring, you know, including a possible debt to equity conversion, that they have firmly rejected any request for a haircut. In fact, MTNL had earlier proposed a repayment plan offering to pay only about 40% of the dues, which we understand banks have turned down. Now, our sources also indicate that lenders have made representations to the Ministry of Finance, stressing that a haircut from a government owned entity will send a negative message and send a troubling precedent for the industry. Now keep in mind, collectively, these lenders have an exposure of nearly 7,900 crores to MTNL, and this is where they will have to make higher provisions in the current quarter, while another 27,700 odd crores of the company's debt is in bonds that are backed by a sovereign guarantee, so there's no issue there. Now the company had disclosed earlier this month that it had defaulted on 519 crores of repayments to Union Bank, Bank of India, SBI, PNB, Punjab and Sindh Bank, as well as Yuko Bank, and some of these lenders we spoke to said that given MTNL's weak financial position, it will probably require an intervention on external help in the form of capital support from the government of India for the company to meet its repayment obligations. A meeting of the lenders is expected soon to deliberate on this debt recast plan. Okay, thank you very much uh, for that. Uh, we're going to slip into a very short break with the news that it's absolutely flat on the Nifty in the sense.